in our previous class we had seen how to install a agent in the on premise application or a machine in our case we had considered the example of installing the connectivity agent in ubuntu operating system which is running in the virtual box within my windows computer Now we had already created this connection in our previous class that is a REST based connection and we had told that we will be using this to build the integration and we will demonstrate the use case. Now for the use case what I have done is I have a function which is running in my on-premise Ubuntu machine which is accessible with this URL that is localhost it is running on 8080 and this is the URL. Now we should get the response from here that is a greeting that is hello world. Now I have created the integration that is agent integration. I will walk you through this integration shortly. When I run, I am getting the message as hello world. If I show you the integration over here, let me click on this agent. I have exposed this integration over a REST protocol. This is just a get trigger. So we are not passing any message over here. Now next we are making use of this connection that is the REST on-premise connection which we have created. And I have configured this with the details of the endpoint like this is of the post endpoint. Then I have provided the sample message over here in the response like what we have to get that is similar to this that is it is a JSON message. It will have this message syntax message and the greeting that I have provided in the inline. Okay. Since the URL is a local host when we create the connection some of the time it won't allow you to provide the URL. Now in that case what you can do is you can provide the URL over here in the absolute endpoint. That is if you expand over here, we are having few properties. I have provided the local endpoint, which is the endpoint of the local FN server, which is running in my Ubuntu operating system that I have provided over here, localhost 8080. Now this invocation, it is making use of the agent and it is talking with the agent, which is installed in this OS. And then it is communicating with this localhost 8080 and we are getting the message that is hello world as I shown earlier in this class. So like this we can install the connectivity agent and make use of integration in order to communicate with the local applications running in the on-premise 